拥有自己的房产是将积蓄多年的资金化为最有利的投资，而我们都知道这项投资将有利终生。让我们与 Spectrum 投资公司的 Carl D 一起了解更多关于房地产投资的秘诀。Basically, real estate investing is all about investing and using real estate as the product. So, if you look at the, the meaning of investing, it's purchasing an item or a product with the hope of a future gain or appreciation or a future recurring income. 投资物业并不是在购买房屋本身就算结束了，更重要的是投资业务的那一部分。这里有几种如何处理业务的投资方法。Real estate investing can be summarized into three categories. Number one is capital appreciation, wherein you buy a property, keep it, and then eventually sell it at a higher price. Second is leasing or renting it out. So you buy a property with the hopes of getting regular cash flow from the rental. Another one is subleasing. Subleasing is like the, the Changge model, wherein one entrepreneurial businessman will lease the whole space and then will lease it out on a smaller scale to different uh, businessmen. 仔细看一下这些投资秘诀，尤其近年来公寓投资越来越繁盛了。但是在投资物业之前，我们需要知道些什么吗 ？Just to give you a background there, with the recent uh, growth of the property, I see a lot of condos being built, no? and I see a lot of uh, investors buying condo to rent it out. So the first step I made is, number one, is to know your market. So it's very important that you understand who will rent your property. If you're in an office area, then you design your unit catering to that market. Number two is furnishing your unit. So it's also very important that you design your unit to suit your target market. So if you're targeting the, the office market, maybe what they will look for is a relaxing place after their stressful work. So you can give them like a nice, nicely interior unit. Another step is uh, my tip on how to attract renters to pick your unit. No? It's very important that you design your unit uh, suited to your market. And they say, the trick to keep your tenants long is to provide a lot of storage. They're gonna have a hard time transferring to other units. Another tip that I made is you add value to your unit. This can be as simple as adding a lazy boy. This can be as simple as adding a playroom if you're targeting the family. These are some added features that can make your unit stand out in the rental market. It's very important that you hire a very good photographer to take a picture of your unit and uh, just, just be visible so that they can uh, see your unit that's available. 相信大家都非常关注这些投资概念，所以别错过下一集。Carly跟大家分享的如何出租公寓的六个步骤的第四、五、六步。现在我们知道年轻的专业人士应该首先投资一个家。如果你问什么时候呢，那就是到了检查你